Hey everyone, Exotic Dan here. Welcome back to another video. So today, I am going to be talking to you guys about a pretty serious subject. So today's pretty serious subject deals with a fast food company known as Chick-fil-A. Now, basically, for those who do not know who Chick-fil-A is, Basically, they are a fast food company that was founded on May 23rd of 1946 in Hapeville, Georgia, U.S. by S. Truett, Kathy, and they operate throughout the United States, Canada, and the United Kingdom. Now, basically, um, pretty recently, they have been facing some backlash, like some really negative backlash, and the reason why they are doing, and the reason why they've been receiving this is because they have been racially discriminating against people who are part of the LGBT community. Now, basically, um, this is actually a pretty serious subject because um, I feel like restaurants, restaurants, either if it's fast food or not, restaurants should be accepting everybody, no matter what their race are or no matter what their sex sexual beliefs are. Now, basically, they have been... Now, basically, one thing that I do find really crazy about this is that Chick-fil-A actually does know that they are basically... They, they actually do know that they are basically being really racist against people who are in the LGBT community, and they're actually treating this as if, as if it's nothing. Yes, they are treating this as if it's nothing, like as if it never happened before. They're just treating it like it's a normal thing. Um, so basically, this is really wrong, and I don't think they should be doing this. Um, and it's really disgusting to see people getting discriminated against just because of what they believe in and what their preferences are. It's just absolutely horrible, and I don't think anybody should be treated like this. This is like one of the most horrible things that you could ever do to anybody. You should never be racist to anybody, no matter what their shape is, what their beliefs or preferences are, um, or if they have like a visible or invisible disability. This could literally be like, like no matter what it is, you should not be like, uh, be basically being a diogratory against people um, just because they have like a different belief in you or a different, pre or a different presence as you. Like no matter what it is, you shouldn't be like, racially discriminating against people no just 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 because they have a different belief of you or a different um preference of you or a different like different anything really like no matter what it is nobody should be like nobody should be um nobody should really, like really go through this so basically um what how this was discovered is that there are these lgbt there was this lgbt couple who went to a Chick-fil-A restaurant to order some stuff. And apparently, the employee there knew that they somehow found out that they were part of the LGBT community. So what they so what the employee did in order to figure in order to basically find this out or not find this out. So what they did to this couple who were part of the LGBT community is that he just straight up refused to serve them. Now this is something really wrong because what happens if this because what happens if Chick Fil A is like the only place to eat? Like there are like there are situations like this where there's only like one restaurant to eat at, and you'll pretty much only and that's pretty much going to be like your only option to eat at if the other place is closed or there's no other place close by to it. Like there are places like this, and I have experienced places like this, like. On the highway of to from the from the North Vancouver Island area to the Central Vancouver Island area, um, on the highway there is a Chevron gas station with a Triple Zeros restaurant. So if you're hungry, that's pretty much going to be your only option. You're pretty much going to have to eat at the Triple Zeros restaurant unless you're going to have something from from the Chevron gas station. Um, but I know that a lot of people don't really eat gas station food. But anyway, that's for another video. Um, but really, what they are doing is not okay, and I really think that they should be doing something about this. I feel like they should be issuing a public apology for this, because this is um, very wrong, and it's also very diogratory, and it's also very racist as well. Nobody, 
And I mean nobody should be treated like this. This is not okay at all. No matter like what they believe in, what their preferences may be, um, what color they may be, what shape they come in, um, or if they have a visible or invisible disability, they should not be they should not be like uh, discriminated against. It's very wrong, and nobody should ever go through this. Like many many people have actually gone through this, and it's not okay. We act because believe it or not, we actually had um, because believe it or not, we actually had people like this um, before. Um, like we had many. Like, like Chick Fil A is not the only company who has been doing stuff like that. Like this, there are other companies who have been doing this, and they also know that they are doing something that is wrong, and they're treating it like as if it's nothing or as if it never happened. And these companies that do this type of stuff, they need to be called out, and they should be publicly ashamed of what they are doing. It should never. Be like racism and discrimin and discrimination. They should not be a thing. They should never. Nobody should ever have to go through this. This is totally a horrible and wrong decision that they are doing, and I feel like that they should not be doing this at all. It's a very horrible uh, thing. Like you shouldn't be refusing. Um, a customer's service just because of what they believe in or what their preferences may be or what their color may be, what their shape may be, or if they have a visible or invisible disability. We are all human in the end of the day and we all deserve something to eat. No matter what we believe in, no matter what our preferences may be, no matter, no matter what color or shape we come in, or no matter if we have an invisible or visible disability or not, it is not okay to, to discriminate against somebody just because of those things. It is a horrible thing to do. Anyways, I think this is where I'm going to end off today's video. If you guys happen to enjoy this video or found this video useful, please make sure you hit that like button. And also, don't forget to subscribe because I do videos every single day. And also, don't forget to ring that notification bell so you never miss a single video that I upload. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my second channel. My second channel will be the third link in the description below. And also, if you guys would like to send me fan art, you guys can send me fan art on my Instagram. My Instagram will be the second link in the description below. And if you guys would like to join my Roblox fan group, you guys can join my Roblox fan group. My Roblox fan group will be the first link in the description below. And if you guys would like to follow me on Twitter, you guys can uh, follow. You, you guys, you guys can find my Twitter in the fourth link in the description below. And until then, I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.